We're here in front of a massive cleaning machine here, Matt. Now, there's the Eco C Core. What's special about this machine? This is our award-winning uh, Eco C Core. It's uh, won a design award uh, in Germany uh, when it was first introduced. Uh, it's very powerful solvent cleaning uh, machine. So, typically hydrocarbons uh, used in here, polar solvents, which are modified alcohols. You, you can choose. And here, uh, with the processes, we can apply multiple processes to the cleaning parts or the parts to be cleaned. So what different processes can you do with this machine? Two tanks, so we can wash, rinse, uh, we can use uh, spray technology, we can use injection flood wash which is immersion, we can introduce ultrasonics and we can introduce a vapour because we have a large distillation unit inside and introduce a vapour degreasing, so a vapour phase. So there's loads of different options. Absolutely. And you don't want the parts wet. It's not allowed to bring the parts wet out of the uh, chamber. We don't want any solvent losses through washing. And so the parts are dried, 100% perfectly dried through the vacuum technology. And we, we remove the air from the chamber, which effectively dries through evaporation. Which is amazing. I, I, watched the, I watched it earlier, and it sucks all the air out, and basically it kind of all, the, all the remaining solvent boils off yep. like, almost instantly. It doesn't take very long and so the part comes out perfectly dry, which I guess you don't get with many other types of process. That's right, that's right. And it's all down to the, the power of, of the uh, um, vacuum technology on there and the sealing of the machine and the integrity and build strength of the machine. So why do you need all these different options? Why do you need the immersion, injection, uh, vapour? To clean parts uh, needs multiple processes. Um, a bit like washing a, a breakfast plate up at home. You, you rinse the, the particles off, you use soap and water to, to degrease it, you rinse again and you dry with a cloth. Now depending on the material, the product, the shape of the material, uh, whether it's a bulk fill or individual parts, to get to the contamination, you may need different processes. So you may need uh, the type of solvent you're using, the type of media, the time, exposure time, and then the different processes around that, whether you're spraying, uh, uh, and uh, injection flood washing. So the combination of all these will give you an effect and different combinations will give you different effects on the part. So you've got those different options but the basket also rotates around as with all the other EcoClean products as well. How do you make sure the parts are held securely inside the basket while they're rotating around? Yeah. Importantly, not all parts should rotate. If you've got sensitive parts which may be bruised if they uh, bash against each other, then you would talk make some sort of fixture, like a toast rack, to, to hold a component in a specific position. Uh, the next is, so if you, if you uh, don't hold it still, you can oscillate or interval oscillate or we can fully rotate. So when it comes to all those different ways of, uh, of moving the basket, how easy is that? Obviously, you need to program all of those on the controls, including all the different washing options. How easy is the control to program what looks like quite a complicated machine? Yeah. Well, even I can use it, and I'm like a technician, so it's a recipe driven. So uh, to program, it's yes, no, on, off, longer, shorter, in seconds. It's not CNC programming, so it's, it's very simple. Uh, supervisor, operator can do it in a few seconds and set a recipe. One, two, three recipes. In this machine, uh, 16 recipes uh, are common, uh, but typically customers will use three. A short, medium and long. So, that's, so the long is for the really difficult to wash parts, like a big engine blocks, big deep holes, pockets yeah, and, yes. and bores. Yeah, valve blocks, uh, something with internal uh, features, blind holes, threads, awkward angles, where you have to get a lot of penetration of the media. And that's why you need then the energy inside the chamber to penetrate those difficult areas. So if someone's worrying about trying to, they've got some, maybe someone manually cleaning a valve block or something, which must be a really time consuming process. Can they come to uh, can they come to Eco, Eco Clean and try out uh, one of your products with their components? And that's why we're here. Yeah. So we never sell a machine uh, just on a, a theory. Uh, we validate and test every single uh, component uh, that a customer has in order to prove out that we can achieve the standards that they require. Different parts need different uh, requirements and different standards. So you just heard it from Matt, if you've got any problems with washing complex components or volumes of components, get in touch with Matt from EcoClean or uh, David from Premium Machine Tools who supply the EcoClean products. You can come and try it in this facility right now, bring your components over, I'm sure they'll solve your problems.